Hack tool wins you to do patcher is a detection of Microsoft defenders that you can see popping up in the system. It typically flags the unwanted programs that is actively running in the system and can lead to excessive ads, notifications, or system settings being modified without your consent. In this video, I will explain how dangerous it is, whether it can be a false positive, and how to remove it. In normal circumstances, hack tool wins it to do patch or detection flags a program that can do a lot of unwanted actions behind the scenes. Patch or name suggests it originally serves to activate the license of a certain program without payment. Yet the rep that this thing can use to make you download and run it may vary wildly. Any kind of Windows activators, questionable programs from the web, or even cracked versions of popular software, all these can contain this patcher inside. When the program is truly dangerous, the symptoms are pretty easy to notice, even for a basic user. You can start seeing advertisements on every page you visit. Some of the search queries may be redirected to a different search engine. In some cases, the unwanted app may tinker with system settings, making the computer sluggish or disabling certain functionality. In any case, it is not a thing that you will happily keep in your system. There is also a possibility of this detection being a false positive. The rules used for this detection are not highly reliable. If the defender cannot find the digital certificate of the file or it is expired, it can indicate the file as dangerous, as a lot of functions and calls that normal programs use also appear in malware. The certificate in this case is the only way to distinguish between good and bad. But how to understand whether you should worry about the hack tool Win City 2 patcher detection or not? Manual analysis may be complicated, especially since malicious programs can sometimes mix their files with legit applications. For that reason, I recommend running a second opinion scan with Greninsoft and Timelware. It will quickly reveal whether there is any threat to your system or not. Download it by the link in the video description and run a full scan. So the program will go through all the system elements, down to configuration files and hidden folders. The scan will take around 15 minutes. After the scan, click the Clean Now button to remove the detected malware. If no detections appear during the scan, then you have likely seen a false positive detection. But when there are malicious programs, I would recommend you to reset all the passwords that you have in the system. This way, cybercriminals will not be able to use the leaked credentials. In any case, good luck and stay safe online.